हाई यूट्यूबर्स वेलकम टू इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स टू दि पॉइंट गेन मार्जिन हाउ डू वी कैलकुलेट गेन मार्जिन फॉर द गिवेन ट्रांसफर फंक्शन सी लेट एस वी आर गिवेन विद ट्रांसफर फंक्शन हेच ऑफ एस दिस ओपन टू ट्रांसफर फंक्शन हेच ऑफ एस इज इक्वल टू के बै एस सी इंटू वन प्लस एस टी वन वन प्लस एस टी टू फॉर दिस वी हेव टू कैलकुलेट द गेन मार्जिन लेट एस पुट एच एस इक्वल टू जे ओमेगा के बै जे ओमेगा वन प्लस जे ओमेगा टी वन वन प्लस जे ओमेगा टी टू फॉर दिस टू ऑप्टेन द फेस क्रॉस ओवर फ्रिक्वेंसी that is omega pc what we do is angle of h of j omega is equal to minus 180 degrees by putting the angle is this transfer functions angle is equal to minus 180 degrees we will get the omega pc value see how this is in denominator right so this omega when it comes up it will be h of j omega is equal to minus 90 degrees this will when it goes up minus tan inverse of omega t1 minus tan inverse of omega t2 by 1 by 1 okay now if we equalize this to minus 180 degrees by calculate by doing the substitution part we are going to get omega pc some value let's go x now what we do is we have to substitute this omega pc value in the magnitude part of h of j omega that is magnitude of h of j omega at omega equal to omega pc is equal to k by j into omega pc into 1 plus j into omega pc t1 into 1 plus j omega pc into t2 by calculating sorry by substituting and by doing calculations we will get some value let us uh, let us consider this k value is equal to 1 in the question we are going to be asked the to find the value of k gain gain k now in this example let us consider this value be k is equal to 1 okay now for this let us consider this will be ga now gain margin gain margin kg is equal to 1 by ga right what is this kg is equal to 1 by modulus of g of j omega h of j omega this is the at omega equal to omega pc this g of j omega h of j omega is nothing but h of s or kg is equal to 1 by modulus of h of j omega at omega equal to omega pc we are going to get some value kg is the gain margin in decibels how to calculate in decibels in decibels gain margin kg is equal to twenty log kg that is twenty log one by g a this is how we calculate the gain margin this is the concept and we have to apply this for whatever the given transfer function okay face margin how do we calculate face margin for the given transfer function let us consider we are given with transfer function h of s is equal to 1 by s into 1 plus st1 1 plus st2 
let us put s equal to j omega h is equal to j o h of j omega is equal to 1 by j omega into 1 plus j omega t1 1 plus j omega t2 so now first we have to find gain crossover frequency that is omega gc how do we calculate gain crossover frequency we have to put magnitude of h of j omega is equal to 1 by equalizing the magnitude of h of j omega is equal to 1 we will get the omega gc that is 1 by omega under root 1 plus omega t1 whole square under root 1 plus omega t2 whole square is equal to 1 by doing the substitution we are going to get omega this omega gc is equal to some value now after obtaining the omega gc what we do is we have to calculate phi that is phase at gain crossover frequency how do we calculate this phi gc is equal to angle of h of j omega at omega is equal to omega gc what we do phi gc is equal to c j omega right so minus 90 degrees it is going to up so minus 90 degrees minus tan inverse of omega t1 by 1 minus tan inverse of omega t2 by 1 so now in this put omega is equal to omega gc by uh, substituting this omega equal to omega gc in this we are going to get some angle let it just be x degrees now face margin gamma is equal to 180 degrees plus phi gc this is the face margin we have to substitute the phi gc obtained value in this so that face margin is equal to 180 degrees plus x degrees this will be the face margin the point to be remembered is we will be finding this gain margin and face margin to open loop transfer function so the stability of the closed loop transfer function is analyzed from the open loop transfer functions gain margin and face margin so gain margin should be greater than 1 or if considered in decibels it has to be positive face margin should be positive angle then therefore the closed loop system will be stable you know your one click on my subscribe button means a lot to me please subscribe thank you